Reverse engineering is the process of capturing 3D digital definitions of physical objects. It is a tool for design, visualization, documentation, analysis, tooling, and inspection, spanning nearly every process in the manufacturing of a product. Reverse engineering, 3D scanning, data capture, digitizing, these terms are used interchangeably. While industry has not settled on a name for the technology, it is clear that reverse engineering is much more than the sole application of copying and interrogating an existing product's design. With the wide array of applications and the technological advances, the use of reverse engineering is expanding, but the industry has only scratched the surface. There are nearly 100 companies that offer reverse engineering technology, which can make the topic daunting. However, as the experts explain, starting with a general understanding of the differences and advantages by category can make the technology easier to understand. In today's marketplace, there are a lot of options. We boil it down to three basic categories. The portable CMM machines where you can physically contact the, the object with a rigid arm to get discrete points. Then there's the white light systems that look at broad areas and give you very dense coordinate point clouds. And then there's the laser-based systems that utilize reflective laser or time of flight to determine where the actual location of the surface is. While primarily used as a touch probe method for inspection and quality control, the stationary CMMs also fit into a discussion of reverse engineering. Additionally, both the portable CMMs, which are articulated arms, and the stationary CMMs can be fitted with laser scanning technology, turning them into non-contact scanning systems.